Welcome to Electron Online. In this video, we're going to introduce you to a new symbol. The symbol greater than or less than. And here they are. When it's written like this, it means the left side is greater than the right side. If you look at a symbol that looks like this, the left side is less than the right side. And the way to remember that is notice here we have the point part of that symbol. That means less than. And here's the open part of the symbol that means greater than. Here's the open part of the symbol, greater than, the pointy part of the symbol, less than. Sometimes we use it in combination to, with the equal sign. For example, here we write, the symbol says greater than or equal to. So a single line underneath, notice we don't use a double line like in the normal equal sign, we use a single line, but this means greater than or equal to. And when we have written it like this, with the pointy side to the left, we mean less than or equal to. Some examples will help us understand it. Here we have an expression that says x, the unknown number, is greater than 5. Since x is on the left side of the symbol like this, the open side of the symbol, this must be greater than the number 5. The number 5 is on the pointy side of the symbol, which means that x can be 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and so forth, as long as it's greater than 5. If we write it like this, the unknown number is less than 5. That means it must be a smaller number. For example, 4, 3, 2, and so forth. And if we write it in conjunction with the equal sign, here we write x is greater than or equal to 5, which means it can also be 5 and then a number greater than 5. So x can be 5 because it's equal to or 6, 7, 8, which means greater than. If we write it like this, x is smaller than or less than or equal to 5, then you can see it can be equal to 5 or number less than 5, like 4, 3, 2, and so forth. And that's what those symbols mean. Now that you have the hang of this, let's go try some examples on our next video.